Several of the senior leadership got together and sort of put our heads together and said, we need to say something about this topic um, because there's so much nonsense that's being said. Yeah. Uh, so I'll just go ahead and read it. Absolutely. Following the tragedy in Newton, Connecticut, there's been much talk on the internet and social media about possible connections between autism spectrum disorders and planned violence. In particular, many have, been many have discussed the unconfirmed rumor as of yet that the individual who perpetrated the tragedy uh, may have had um, Asperger's disorder, may have been diagnosed with Asperger's. Uh, we feel it's important to weigh in on this topic because the vast majority of the chatter on this subject is based on misinformation, rumor, uh, and fear, as is understandable. Uh, but the plain and simple fact is that individuals with autism spectrum disorders are not a danger to their community. A minority of individuals with ASD display fleeting, low-intensity, uh, disruptive or aggressive behaviors such as tantrums, hitting or biting, but these behaviors are in no way whatsoever related to school shootings or planned violence of any other sort. There's no connection. Let it be said clearly and without hesitation. People with autism are, are no more likely to commit atrocities than anyone else. The sad truth of the matter is that individuals with ASD are far, far more likely to actually be victims of violence and bullying than they are to commit it themselves. So it's natural to want to find a source of blame in the wake of an event as unspeakable as that which occurred in Newtown. But blaming autism, or even implying that autism spectrum disorders played a contributing role, is simply not supported by the facts. Thank you so much, because in this, this horrible tragedy and this sea of information, a lot of misinformation, we need a clear voice. And I thank you for being that clear voice and for bringing this statement that is officially from the Center for Autism and Related Disorders.